In this video, we will investigate using the cross product to, sim to solve a proportion. A proportion is made up of two equal fractions, or rational expressions. The cross product, we should recognize as saying that if we multiply the diagonals, 20 times 9 is 180, and the other diagonal, 6 times x, to get 6x, we'll get an expression that is equal. This problem is easy to solve by dividing both sides by 6. When we divide by 6, we get x is equal to 30. And we'd have our solution for x. It could be quickly verified by using your calculator that 20 over 6 is approximately 3.33, and 30 over 9 is also approximately 3.33. We now have the same thing on both sides of the equation. However, a more interesting problem to us in algebra would be one more like this, where we have a rational expression x plus 3 over 4 equals 2 fifths. Again, we can apply the same cross product property. However, we must also remember that if there is more than one term in the, in the numerator, it must be in parentheses. This means we have 5 times the quantity x plus 3 is equal to the other diagonal, 4 times 2, or 8. This gives us an equation we can also quickly solve with just a few more steps. Distribute the 5 through the parentheses to get 5x plus 15 equals 8, and then solve the resulting two-step equation. Subtract 15 from both sides to get 5x equals negative 7, and finally, divide both sides by 5, and x is equal to the fraction negative 7 fifths, or negative 2.4. We have our solution. We could verify this solution by again dividing 2 by 5 to get 0 0.4, or we'll use the decimal negative, did I say 2? negative 1.4, sorry, negative 1.4 plus 3 gives us 1.6 over 4, and when we divide that by 4, we also get the same 0 0.4 on both sides of the equation. Our answer is correct. We solve proportions, or two equal rational expressions, by multiplying the cross product to get an e equation we could solve from there.